Hello, book leaguers, parents, teachers, and caregivers. Welcome to Book League Storytime Adventures. I have not been this excited to release a video in a long time. Maybe not that long. It was Elephant and Piggy Volume 2 when I was this excited. And now this is Elephant and Piggy Volume 3 and I can hardly contain myself. I even wore my Elephant and Piggy shirt. The one I wear every time I read. And yes, I do wash it in between readings, but let me get back to the matter at hand. Five new videos from Elephant and Piggy combined into one video that you can skip to the book of your choice or watch it all the way through. I'll put links in the description below for the other Elephant and Piggy volumes that are out. And then I know you've heard me say it before, but reading is the most important thing you can do for your brain. So keep doing it. But it's time to start the video. So let's go. <laughs> My New Friend is So Fun by Mo Willems. I'm not messing around with this intro. Hi, Gerald. Hi, Snake. Have you seen Piggy? Piggy just met Brian Bat for the first time. Now they are playing. Fun. Brian Bat is nice. I know. Brian is my best friend. Piggy is my best friend. Hmm. Hmm. Both Piggy and Brian are so nice. They must be having a really fun time. Yeah. They must be having a super fun time. Yeah. They must be having a super duper fun time. Yeah. They must be having a... Oh, no. What if... What if they are having too much fun? How can they have too much fun? They could be having more fun than they have with us. More fun? Much more fun. Much more fun? If they are having that much fun together, then maybe they do not need us. I do not want to lose my best friend! I do not want to lose my best friend! We must do something! We must tell them to stop having fun! Piggy! Brian! <laughs> oh! Oh, hi, Gerald. Hi, Snake. Piggy, Brian, we have to tell you something. So do we. You do? We have to tell you how much fun we are having. So much fun. We, we have, have been, been playing, playing best, best friend games. games. Best friend games? It's best friend fun. Best friend fun? We even made best friend drawings. Best, best friend, friend drawings? drawings? It's worse than we feared. We are doomed. Do you want to see our drawings? I must cover my eyes. I cannot cover my eyes. Ta-da! Oh! You made drawings of... Us! Of course! You are our best friends! What did you have to tell us? Have, have fun, fun with, with your, your new friend. friend! Kids, remember, keep reading. Read lots of Elephant and Piggy books. And read, 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 read everything. It's so good for your brain. Yes, it is. Bye. In this story, Piggy has a surprise for Gerald. What will the surprise be? And will Gerald have the patience to wait for it? Stick around and find out. Without further ado, I present to you, Waiting is Not Easy by Mo Willems. 
Gerald! I have a surprise for you. Yay! What is it? The surprise is a surprise! Oh. Is it big? Yes. Is it pretty? Yes. Can we share it? Yes! I cannot wait! You will have to. Wait? What? Why? The surprise is not here yet. So I will have to wait for it? Yes. Oh! Oh well. If I have to wait, I will wait. I am waiting. Waiting is not easy. Piggy, I want to see your surprise now! I am sorry, Gerald, but we must wait. Oh! I am done waiting. I do not think your surprise is worth all this waiting. I will not wait anymore. Okay, I will wait some more. It will be worth it. Oh! Oh, gosh! Piggy, we have waited too long. It is getting dark. It is getting darker. Soon, we will not be able to see each other. Soon, we will not be able to see anything. We have wasted the whole day! Well, um... We have waited and waited and waited and waited! And for what? For that! <gasps> This was worth the wait. I know. Tomorrow morning, I want to show you the sunrise. I cannot wait. You should change your name to laughter. You bring joy to every I am going to read a elephant and piggy book. It's called I Will Take a Nap by Mo Willems. This is a very important topic. As a father of three kids, I know if my kids are cranky, they're either hungry or they need to go to sleep. In this book, Gerald is cranky because he needs a nap. I'm not going to spoil it, but what I will say is it is funny. Follow along with me. I am tired and cranky. I will take a nap. I like to nap. I am happier when I am rested. I hope I have good dreams. Hmm. Gerald! Huh? What? Where? When? How? Oh, ah! What are you doing? I am trying to take a nap because I am tired and cranky. And a nap helps if you are cranky? Yes, a nap helps if you are cranky! I am sorry, Piggy. I am very cranky. Now I feel cranky, too. Very cranky. Maybe I need a nap. Maybe you do need a nap. I will take a nap, too. I like to nap with my special buddy. Ready to nap? Ready to nap. Sleep tight. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> 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 
Oh, oh gosh. Great nap. I feel rested. I do not feel cranky. How are you enjoying your nap, Gerald? Hmm. I am not enjoying my nap, Piggy. I am not napping. But if you are not napping, how can I be floating? And why is my head a turnip? Good question. I'm a floating turnip head. She's, She's a, a floating, floating turnip, turnip head. head. She's a floating turnip head. <laughs> She's, She's a floating, a floating turnip, turnip head. head. <laughs> I'm floating. Also, I have a turnip head. <sighs> Oh, hi, Gerald. Did you have a good nap? I sure did, turnip head. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! I still laugh when I think of Piggy with a turnip head. What are you talking about? Ha! <laughs> Doesn't matter. Anyway, kids. If you ever feel super cranky, do not fight your parents. Take that nap or go to sleep. You'll feel much better afterwards, I promise. And you know a trick? I like to read before bed. It helps me sleep. See you soon. Bye. In this elephant and piggy story, Piggy tries to share his love of slop with Gerald. Will Gerald like it? I'm not sure. Stick around and find out. And without further ado, I present to you, I Really Like Slop by Mo Willems. La la la. Hi, Gerald. Hi, Piggy. Yikes! What is that? This is Slop. Slop? Yummy, yummy Slop. Yummy? You eat that? Sure I eat this. Pigs really, 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 really like slop. Eating slop is part of pig culture. Oh. Should it smell like that? <sighs> Yes! What about all of those flies? The flies are how you know it's ripe! Yeah, man. Do you want to try my slop? Do I want to try your slop? No way! Ah! Oh. Okay. Piggy? Wait. Yes, Gerald? I will... Gulp! Try your slop. Yay! Maybe you will really like slop. Maybe. Try a big taste. I will try a small taste. That is a small taste. 
You are close to trying uh, slop. Oh, 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 you are closer. Oh, oh help. Closer. Oh, oh you tried it. Spicy, huh? Do you know how I get that old shoe taste? Old shoes! So, do you really like slop? Um, no, I do not really like slop, but I am glad I tried it, because I really like you. Oh, Gerald. Dessert? Don't push it, bub. Wow, that was fun, wasn't it, kids? Yeah. I love slop. Oh. Yummy. And I love you, Piggy. And you too, reader. Come visit us soon. Check out our playlist for more Elephant and Piggy stories. Bye. I am going to read yet another Elephant and Piggy book. Those two guys are hilarious. I love them. And I know you do too, which is why you're listening. And this book, Piggy, is going to try to thank everyone that is important to him. Gerald doesn't think he can do it. Do you? Stick around and find out. Without further ado, I present to you The Thank You Book by Mo Willems. I have a lot to be thankful for. I had better get thanking. I am going to thank everyone who is important to me. Huh? Everyone? Everyone. No way. You will forget someone. You will forget someone important. I will thank everyone. It will be a thank rama Wow. Off I go. Squirrels! Piggy! Thank you for your great ideas. Aw, shucks. Steak! Piggy! Thank you for playing ball with me. The pigeon! Thank you for never giving up. And I am sorry you do not get to be in our books. That is what you think. Thanking is nice, but you will forget someone. I will not. Mouse, birdies, rhino, hippo's big sister, barky dog, pelican, bear, hippo, worms. Thank you all for being great friends. See that, Gerald? I am a thinking machine. Piggy, you have forgotten someone important. Do not worry, Gerald. My next thanks will be a big one. Good. Thanks, Whale! You are nice. So are you. Ice cream penguin. Thank you for your ice cream. It is what I do. Piggy. Dr. Cat. Thank you for being a great doctor. You are welcome. Piggy. Brian Bat. Thank you for drawing with me. 
That was fun. Peggy! You are forgetting someone. Someone very important. Really? Oh, now I know who you're talking about. The flies. Thank you for cooking with me. Anytime, dude. Not the flies, Piggy. I cannot think of anyone else I have forgotten to thank, Gerald. Oops! I goofed. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Elephant Gerald. You are the best friend a pig could ever have. That means a lot to me, Piggy. But I did not think that you forgot me. Who did I forget to thank? Our reader. You forgot to thank our reader. You are right. Thank you for being our reader. We could not be us without you. You are the best. You did it. Great thanking, Piggy. Thanks to you. Yep, I am one lucky pig. Thank you for joining us through Book League Storytime Adventures. Check out our playlist with more elephant and piggy stories. See you soon. <laughs>